free driver education to help you ace your driving test. Truby Cars. This traffic light, we will be turning left. So I have my left uh, signal on. Slowing down, looking in the rear view mirror. Complete stop here. And uh, now we are waiting for the light to turn green. So this uh, left turn, uh, it's like a, you know, it's a T intersection. So it's very simple left hand turn because there's no oncoming traffic. So basically when the light turns green, I just have to, uh, you know, uh, check um, intersection first. So I have to uh, make sure the cross traffic has stopped. There's no pedestrian crossing like this. So I look left, right, looks clear. No pedestrian crossing. I look for a yellow line and I'm keeping my car closer to the yellow line. Now we can switch lanes. So signal, mirror check, shoulder check, move over to the right hand side. We will be turning right on this intersection. So I'm going to uh, signal again and uh, I'm going to do a shoulder check, looks clear. And now we can complete our right hand turn. So I go in the right hand lane first. Um, looking at the signs, uh, they are saying the left lane is going to end. And uh, we are in the right lane, so we are okay. Um, maximum speed limit 50 kilometers but if you have like you know uh, if you're on a two-lane street and the left lane is ending you have to be careful even if you're in the right lane the traffic now from the left hand lane they're gonna come they, they want to come to your side right they have to come to your lane because their lane is ending um, so you you have to uh, you know uh, you have to be careful and you have to uh, uh, you might have to adjust your speed uh, you know um, so the other traffic can merge uh, safely so uh, from this intersection, uh, we are uh, still going straight. Now, I was uh, slowing down a little bit here because we need to uh, make sure um, before we enter in the intersection, there is enough space on the other side because you do not want to get stuck in the intersection. So I'm just gonna change lanes here uh, because um, the bus might uh, take some time. Okay, so let's practice uh, left hand turn on this intersection. So left signal, shoulder check, and we go in the left lane. And now the light is green, so we go in the intersection. Uh, red car is still a little bit far, no pedestrian crossing, so that means we can complete our turn. Speed limit sign on the right hand side, maximum 40 kilometers. Looking at my speed scanning intersection checking my rear view mirror looking at the speed again so let's uh, practice left turn again so left signal shoulder check going in the left lane and uh, complete stop here and i'm leaving about uh, car length distance so uh, let's uh, plan everything. So let's look at the intersection, right? So we have a green light, uh, sorry, we have a red light and uh, we have oncoming traffic. We have uh, pedestrians who wants to cross. Now when the light turns green, this golden car will go in the intersection. They have to wait for the um, uh, pedestrians and the oncoming traffic. And uh, we're just gonna wait here behind the stop line. Now the golden car is moving, so we go in the intersection as well because the light is still green. Scanning uh, oncoming traffic looks clear. Pedestrians have already crossed, so that means we can complete our uh, turn as well. Now I'm going to stay in this lane because uh, we are going to turn left again um, on the next uh, intersection. Okay, uh, so I'm going to signal left and uh, left uh, shoulder check looks clear and we go in the left hand lane light is red so we have to uh, slow down come to a complete stop before the stop line checking my rear view mirror as well and uh, looking at the traffic lights here um, so this one uh, we might actually get a turning signal here so a green arrow that will give us priority but um, nothing is for granted so you still have to um, you know um, you still have to be careful because sometimes you find uh, you know the traffic or um, or uh, pedestrians maybe they were distracted they were not paying attention right so they might actually
try to go through the intersection when they should not be doing that uh, so that's why you always have to be careful okay so this time the arrow did not appear so we just have to go in the intersection I'm moving my car a little bit to the left and uh, now I'm straightening out the car is straight the front tires are straight so um, this position uh, gives me a better view of the oncoming traffic so uh, when I position my car like this now I can see the traffic light I can see oncoming traffic I can also see uh, pedestrians and uh, we can also look in our rear view mirror nobody behind us so far pedestrian has already crossed and um, now we are uh, good to go so after this white car we are good to go okay you always want to go in your uh, first lane first now i'm going to stay in this lane uh, because we will uh, turn left again on this um, intersection so left uh, signal and uh, shoulder check shoulder check is here is optional right because we had those uh, construction uh, uh, cones but um, it's still better uh, you know it's still good if you do it because you want to get in the habit of uh, doing that okay um, so uh, this intersection it will be same thing right so um, we will get a solid green light then we have to um, check oncoming traffic we have to check pedestrians and uh, when it's clear that's when you go sometimes your light will change first when you go in the intersection uh, you're waiting for the oncoming traffic especially around uh, busy time right so if you're in rush hour uh, because that time your light might change first um, so when you see amber light you still look at the oncoming traffic if they are slowing down um, that time you can go if they don't slow down your light will change from amber into red light and that's when you clear the intersection so uh, we will see maybe this time we will get uh, amber light um, so um, right now there's no pedestrian crossing and i'm just going in the intersection the road is completely empty now actually there's no more oncoming traffic so we are uh, good to go uh, speed limit sign on the right hand side maximum 40 kilometers we also have a bicycle lane and this van not sure what they are doing okay um all right so um someone is just um jaywalking so i'm slowing down looking in my rear view mirror as well scanning the intersection so we have a uh, stop sign coming up and uh, we will be turning left on this uh, stop sign there is a sign on the right hand side it shows uh, from this lane uh, you can go straight left or right Sometimes when you have a bigger vehicle turning in front of you like this, uh, like there was a bus turning, uh, you might have to slow down a little bit uh, to give them a um, little bit more space. Okay, space and, um, and time, right? Okay, so um, on the next intersection, uh, there will be a traffic lights uh, coming up and uh, we're gonna be turning right. So I would um, signal right and uh, we have to do a shoulder check here now with the bicycle lane when the line changes into broken white that time you are required to go in the bicycle lane closer to the curve and then you will stop before the stop line if the light is red so now um, there's no pedestrian crossing and there's no uh, cyclist on the side right uh, that's the reason why we are uh, closer to the intersection uh, or closer to the curve um, there's no prohibited sign so i'm just gonna move forward a little bit check traffic looks clear right shoulder check again looks clear and now we can complete our right hand turn free driver education to help you ace your driving test truby cars 